get it. The E Brother Sons. The E Brother Sons. is going on everybody um, today we're going to anime north but first I'm gonna go and get a haircut first um, I've actually never con crunched before but I did this year and I actually finished my costume last night slash this morning at 2 o'clock but like I said I'm going to get a haircut first because this is gonna be hard to manage underneath the helmet and then we'll check in later I guess all right and we are back um as you can see I look like Chinese Harry Potter, low key. Uh, so now I'm gonna have to shower again and get rid of all the little tiny hairs, so yay. All right, and now we are all dressed up. Let me, there we go. Now we are all dressed up. Uh, let me actually go into the washroom so that you can see I'm um, dressed up as what with some slightly better lighting. So here we are, I'm dressed up as the shredder. Um, let me actually point this at the mirror so you can also see what camera I'm using today. So this is the camera that I'm using. This is the Canon L-Series 360HS. And this is the costume, as you can see there. Uh, I've never con crunched before and this is actually the first time that I've ever con crunched and I finished this costume uh, literally 2 a.m. this morning. So yeah, there's certain things that I don't like about it, like the shoulders don't hang exactly the way that I want them to. But that's fine. Um, the other thing is because I already have a pretty wide shoulder width, um, adding the shoulders makes it damn near impossible for, for me to fit through most doors. Like so, I have to kind of like stretch myself out and go in there differently. But you know, I'm pretty satisfied with the costume. Um, and uh, yeah, can't wait to actually go to the convention. All right, so we just made it to Anime North and um, I'm already suited up, of course. And then here we got Kevin. And he's uh, he's currently suiting up as well. Um, and um, I made the biggest mistake of being already suited up in the car because I could barely, well, first things first, I could barely sit in the car, let alone move in it, but it's all good. Yeah, definitely. I'm gonna choose to sit in the back or remove the torso at the very least because all these like scallops too get in the way and um, I had to hold on to my seat belt after I clipped it in and that was a bit annoying but we're here right now um, the weather is nice it's not too warm or anything this is a really really gentle breeze as well so that helps um, we look like terrorists right now um, him more so than me but you know it's all good it's all good sometimes that's how it be sometimes that is how it be you know sometimes you dress up okay I don't know where this joke is going <laughs> Pardon the fact that he's backlit, but look at your back. So, so for Kimikon, he actually um, sort of showed us the work in progress of the big boss, where which I called him the extra medium size box. What are you cosplaying as today, sir? Uh, this is like my work in progress for Big Boss. So it's only middle sized boss, it's not that big. Sure. It's medium, it's extra medium sized. Yeah, like sure. my left testicle. So now he actually has it pretty much complete, I like. Uh, more or less. Yeah. yeah kind and, of missing like a bunch of life. And this looks fucking legit because this shit in the back actually is. So that's a lot of weight, but your boy's gonna get the biggest it like. It doesn't feel that bad because of the whole like load bearing system. Alright, never mind. Because this is a, what call it, this is support based on this, and this is kind of just like on, on me as like a harness. So I thought Never mind, your boys prepare. Oh my god, the sun's actually hot as fuck. Hold on. How are you doing? So as you can see, we have an Asian man in his natural habitat, and in an anime convention once again, and he's looking to find the right beef. So what is it that you're looking for exactly, sir? Uh, one of the artists in the artist alley. Let me zoom in deep into your face. I think this might be a new record for Kevin and I separating already. That that didn't come out right, but we already separated. It's been like, oh, we don't have a watch. <laughs> so basically, we went into the secondhand market after regrouping, and then we got lost again. And then we decided to get dinner. 
with our friend that did not want to be on camera. So I'm not gonna lie, I completely forgot to vlog the whole day because uh, we were just too busy. I actually don't know, we're just too busy like getting lost with each other. That was fun. Do you think that? How was your day today, Kevin Long? Did you eat today? Before coming here? Yeah. You you lucky muddy fucker. So, so I had yeah. like kind of a lunch slash breakfast. So so brunch basically. Yeah, but it was just like more like breakfast. Oh okay. Yeah, the only thing I had today was a nice cap. So. Fuck! I just remembered. I think my parents actually prepped food for me tonight, so I fucked up. Shredder back at it. I don't need an umbrella because my shit's waterproof, but today we got your boy Andrew. Hey yo, what's up? Kevin as Michael Jackson. I'm not Michael Jackson. Sure. And your boy Phil. Oh, no. <laughs> is actually Philip's first convention or what? Nah. Uh, yeah, yeah, it is. Why the fuck you lie? sao mày no lao vầy? Sao mày no đi. Waiting in line with with uh, with Philip and Andrew because Kevin and I already got our passes, of course, from like well before. So so yeah. So we just came back from Tim Hortons and I had like the toughest time eating just because of all this shit. Obviously, I took this off. Uh, right now we're just waiting at the ATM. Um, and while that happened, Kevin actually got like a new hat and a new pair of gloves yeah. that he's not wearing. Goodbye, ten dollar hat. Is that the same one as before he says? Or Except he just... it's a lot better. But a lot better, so it's probably not the same if it's better than is it. Look at this dude. My lady. Yeah, could you tip your cap and say my lady? <laughs> my lady. <laughs> oh, right there. <laughs> my lady. <laughs> so right when we thought that we lost Kevin, we found him. So it's been about like a few hours uh, and within those few hours we met up with like a whole bunch of people and then we all dispersed. Uh, Kevin's at a photo shoot right now. Uh, so with me is Phil and Andrew and as you see Andrew's picking his nose. And Phil's looking at Pokemon cards like amazing. And I'm actually currently waiting for Ruby. I don't know where she is but she is supposed to meet up with me and uh, I don't see her so. A bit problematic, I don't know where she is. She told me to come to this giant phallic object, uh, but, I, <laughs> but I don't know where she is right now. OMG, look who it is! <gasps> it's Ruby! So Ruby just wrapped up her photo shoot and she looked really pretty. Ruby, watch out! Take a step back, take a step back. So I have to watch over her because she's a really clumsy trapezoid, so. Blackout! It's the ghost of Michael Jackson, he's still alive! Look at this dude! I Bro, this fool even has one glove on, I'm telling you, he's straight up Michael Jackson today. Alright, so we just wrapped up at Anime North, um, and yes, I got this black pink out, shoutouts to, to Phil for getting me that, um, and Sweaty as well. So right now what we're going to do is we spot this car earlier, but I didn't bust out the camera quick enough. Ch check out this fuck. This is like fucked up oh, red car. Is that the one? I, I think it's. Yeah, it's right. Yo. Oh, right there. What the fuck is this? What the fuck is that? Shit. Jeez. All right. So right now we are back at Anime North. I actually have the full DSLR set up today, and um, 
randomly this man decides to show up for some reason. Hey. And we don't know why. I am I am what using the mean? steady cam today, so I get to do shit like this. Where it's all nice and smooth. Andrew's back. Hey yo. Phil's here as well. Ow. And, a joker. and then in there is 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 the man with the plan. Uh, uh, the general from Vietnam. I'm not from. <laughs> I'm not from Vietnam. It's a bush. <laughs> and uh, I, I really don't know exactly what we're going going to be doing today. Um, obviously, we are at Anime North, but I feel like we're gonna probably leave early, like how we did last year, and then we're gonna do some next shit. Um, but yeah, today I'm not a shredder, so I could actually vlog a little bit more. Unfortunately, I fucked up my neck this morning, so I can't even turn my head past here. Which is really painful. I still did bring this with me for some reason though. The, the little tiny ass camera. I don't know. I mean, and when, you're, when you're inside, right? Why would you want to be holding this giant thing up? Right? So obviously, having this is a little bit more useful in that situation. So, so fuck you, dude. So, yeah. this is, I told you, use that blink. So fun fact, this is, actually, uh, this is actually from Sweetie's very first video on YouTube. I already have some videos on YouTube. Man. I said very first. Oh, okay. Because I care, because I know shit. So it looks like your boy Philip's gonna become a vlogger now, eh? Not a vlogger. You look like one though. All right, so right now we are inside the uh, TCC. Um, Philip's gonna be taking photos of strangers. Uh, Andrew's just gonna chill with us. And um, Kevin is like right there. And he's um, looking for his last revolver. And Sweetie has to get his um, his pass first. So yeah, the dope thing about actually having a camera now and not having to worry about armor and stuff is I can actually like vlog and not need to like constantly be wary of that shit. And also, I'm a little bit more quicker and more aware of shit. The major problem though is because it did fuck up my neck, I still can't turn my head all the way. But at least I can hear everything now. So there's that. This one turned like that. I, I tried it already. I'm just like. <laughs> okay, that actually does feel like it helps, but fuck it. So yeah, we're just gonna be waiting for Spitty and uh, and Kevin to finish up first, and then we'll start the day. I also felt like today would be a good day for me to play around between these two cameras and sort of see like what are the results of each. Obviously, I'm familiar with how this is gonna turn out, but I never really realized or took the time to see how this is gonna turn out properly at least. So today will be a really good test trial for that purpose. Um, so by extension, that means that I do, I am carrying two cameras with me, and then of course, your boy Phil's also carrying a camera with them. And. Um, yeah, Andrew. I offered Andrew my SL1, and he was like, no, I'm good, my phone should be good enough. So, so yeah, it is what it is. But I can just pull it off and like, alright, take a picture. Well, I could just pull this out too. Yeah, we know that thing do well. That's pretty quick though, with the setup. But, but yeah, well, we're, just, we're still waiting. Because Kevin lost his revolver and he's going to look for it. But then again, it's only four bucks, bro. Like, come on. <laughs> So the dope thing about having this guy over here is I could do a floating camera shot like this where basically everything is completely stable and not moving at all and it looks like it's a floating camera. Um, I don't think I would be able to do that with my little tiny little Elf, Elf series camera but it is something that I like to play around with sometimes. For a purpose like this it's very, um, dare I say, unnatural and unnecessary but it is possible. So, so this is gonna be a who wore it better. We have fill up entry. And also we found Marco. Where did you go, dude? Why didn't you wait for us? So right now, um, everyone has reunited and we're gonna go to the gaming hall first because Phil wants to check out uh, their cards and shit. It's called a trap box, man. What? It's called a trap box. It, it lures you in and give you trash. Pretty much. Um, I haven't, like, I spent the past two days scoping out stuff that I might want to buy and um, I wasn't able to find what I really wanted, which was the, um, 
the NECA Ninja Turtles, like from the movie. So as a result, I'm actually going to just get my Constellation Prize, which will be the Captain America shield that I saw, and, um, and some Wolverine claws. So we just walked by the Beyblade tournament, and these kids are taking this shit seriously. Like, these kids have, like, the gloves and everything. It's ridiculous. They have potential, man. Come on. But it's, it's kind of scary though, like, they look like a fucking tiny gang of like, seven-year-olds and shit. <laughs> and shortly after that, we all got lost. Cause, you know, that's what we do.